What's going on guys? Today is my first real day exploring out here in Barcelona. I didn't really do all that much yesterday. I just went out at night and got some photos. I've got some pictures, but right now I am walking through the historic Gothic district or El Gotique in medieval Barcelona. And I'm walking over to uh, the main plaza square where there's a cathedral and church. Don't entirely know which way I need to go. But I think I'm just gonna head straight. Every street is different. Every street is unique. And uh, honestly, this is uh, this is really fun. All right, so I just made it to the Gothic Cathedral here in Barcelona. This church was built in the 13th century. This is this is quite cool, guys. I gotta say, but there's so many people. It is so incredibly hot out today. I'm gonna try to go inside. I see there's a huge line of people outside here. Apparently there's a little lift that'll take you up to the top of the towers. So I'm just waiting in line. Okay guys, we just made it to the top of the rooftop. It's just amazing. Just look at this view. That mountain right there is Montjuic. After I leave the cathedral, I'm going to make my way down through the city over to... Um, there's a cable car and I will be on top of that mountain. If you're in Barcelona, you definitely need to come to the top of this cathedral. Honestly, I didn't even expect that there would be a observation deck here. Like everywhere you go, it's like a little square, a little piazza, if you will. People just relaxing, just enjoying the time. And this is the main square right in front of the city hall of Barcelona. There's definitely a lot of security here. Armed guard with a automatic rifle. They said it was popular, they really weren't kidding. Um, this is the main pedestrian uh, thoroughfare in the old city. It's called La Rambla. Monument to Christopher Columbus. He's not from Barcelona, but the reason why there's a monument uh, to him here is because he reported to the king and queen in Barcelona after his voyage uh, to the New World. So right now I'm walking through Port Bell or the Old Harbor in Barcelona and prior to the 92 Olympics that were held here uh, in Barcelona this whole area was a rundown uh, island of factories and railroad yards uh, and they conducted an urban renewal program you guys know I love uh, this kind of work, so now it's a major tourist destination. Uh, I'm walking over to the uh, cable car terminal right now. Alright, so I finally made it guys. Here we go. I think the waiting time is like 60 minutes, which took me an hour and a half to get here, so I'm gonna probably wait it out. Two hours of waiting in line, guys. We're finally here. I may have waited for two hours, but these are pretty spectacular, guys. So the million dollar question, was the aerial tramway uh, worth it or was it not? If you have time to kill, uh, I say go do it. The views were just spectacular and you're able to now explore Montjuic which is where we're at right now. Here you can see the entire old town of Barcelona. All right, I'm taking another cable car because I want to get to the top of Montjuic. There's a castle there. 
do get beautiful views of Barcelona from this cable car though. Looks like a crazy party is going on here. So apparently this castle is an old military fortification uh, and it dates back to 1640. It's still in use by the city today. But check this out. Guess I'm going inside the castle. It's free if you come after three o'clock, otherwise it's five euros. This is... That's one of the things that I love about coming to Europe is that there's always in many places castles and uh, fortifications and you could just walk around and explore. Here's a beautiful view of the entire Barcelona from the top of the hill. Alright guys, well I just made it back down from Montjuic. I spent the past hour trying to figure out a way down and I came across two uh, English speaking girls and we both managed to hitch a cab and we got back down to the center of the city. Uh, it's been a fun day exploring here uh, in Barcelona. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to give me a thumbs up. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I have many more days from Spain and a lot more adventures coming from Europe. I'll see you guys tomorrow.